If you don't have permissions to install software on your computer, there's a workaround. Go to our download site and click this rectangle here and select Portable Edition and download this. Okay, then open it in the download folder and drag it onto the desktop. You can close the browser and now extract the content of the zip file to any folder on your computer or the C drive, for example. I do it here. Now the zip file contents is extracted and you find the Mac Recorder folder here. If you would now launch Mac Recorder, it would start as a regular application and would write the configuration in the application data folder. If you want to have an isolated installation, create a shortcut of the program file. Oh well, Windows 11 always takes an extra click now. Create shortcut. Then right click the shortcut we just created and select properties. Then under target, add the command line parameter minus portable. This will force Mac Recorder to launch in portable mode. If you now double click the shortcut instead of the execution file, it will launch Mac Recorder in portable mode. The portable mode is indicated by the word portable in the title bar. Now everything is stored in the Mac Recorder Portable directory, such as the configuration file you can find here.